All right, welcome back, everyone. You guys gotta check this out. Hold on. Gotta create a new world here. Turns out my seed still works that I can't type. Oh, numb lock. What the heck? Now, at one point, I entered my seed to check it. This is hard to type and do the same time. And I could have swore it spawned me in a completely different world. But now, someone said it still works. So what I did in my description, I would say my seed no longer works and you just have to download my world, but that's not the case anymore. Maybe I saw this and I'm like, okay, this is not my original spawn, but actually, remember, my spawn just changed. So in episode one of this world, I spawned right here. No, it's weird. The brown mushroom's gone. The only mushroom gone from this place is the one I spawned on. I thought that was strange, but look at this. So I don't know if you can get an idea where we're at. That, that spawn over here, this is like a big plains area. There's a ravine with that above it. Another ravine. And heading over this way. Do things look familiar yet? How about now? Does anything look... Oh my gosh. I can just feel it right here. I remember this. Just... Oh man. <laughs> so our big tree is on top of that mountain right there. Our house is right here. Oh my gosh. This is so crazy. You know what's really cool though? In our graveyard area, there's a village that spawned here with a ravine in it. My seat is so cool now. What the heck? Heading back over this way, this is where the entrance of the lab is right there. And look, there's still a village right here. I wonder if it went off the same code like it put a village here again, but it's just an updated one. That doesn't even look like the same mountain, or does it? I guess it does. Man, guys, this is just crazy. <laughs> Looking back at this, the mansion sits right here. Greenhouse is right here. Normal house right there. Wow. This is so cool. A lot of stuff stayed the same. I am so surprised by that. Look over here where our windmill is and that little old barn. We have another one of them nether portal spawns. Man, that whole mountain just got wrecked right there, didn't it? Oh man, what I would do though to have a ravine right there, that would be so cool. And there's a mine shaft down there. <laughs> In this iconic mountain, you know where this is. Right behind here, this is what this forest used to look like, by the way. It's all plains now because it all burnt down. There's a few more features. That wooden mansion still out there too, which is surprising. Um, yeah, so the seed works now. Have fun with it, guys. Back in the lab here, kind of making some desks. And I think I'm going to do this. So <laughs> I did this bottom part of the map. And it had a perfect map right in the ocean that's all blue. So I'm going to use that for my monitors. But I need to think of a block here that'll be good for a keyboard. All right, I'll pick every block that resembles a keyboard in the slightest way. I didn't even realize. Look at the texture on the top of this block. Whoa. Oh, man. Does it go with this pretty well? Oh, it does. That makes me so mad. These are expensive. Man, these are the only blocks that look good. Does that look good? Nah, not really. And of course, in this version, you can't place anything like Java in front of an item frame. What about no block? Wait, that doesn't look too bad. Nah, eh, maybe. What about piston? Nope. Loom? Nope. Actually, yeah, that doesn't look bad at all. Sometimes I just lose a certain shulker box that I really need. And all I can do is just run around my world <laughs> aimlessly. Oh, man, I lost my wood box. I don't know where it is. This is terrible. Okay, finished up this room. I actually really like the way it turned out. Um, I might add some more. I might even keep... Wait, did I do that? Yeah, I think these stay on constantly. I might make a few more. Holy crap, chill out. <laughs> Cave noises are unreal in this. They just keep going off and off. Hopefully they'll fix that soon. But yeah, I just put up some of my maps and my documents. Um, and then the computer tables. Yeah, I like it. Okay, what the heck? <laughs> Someone sent me this and... I thought I'd just try it out right here, but it actually looks good right there, like an exit light. How on earth have I never seen this before? That is a beautiful light. Oh my god, can you imagine that? how simple that would be in some of the rooms I have? Should I keep it there? Like an exit light above the door? You know what? I think I will. That's fitting. Now I gotta go throughout the lab and do this. <laughs> oh. No way. Oh, I didn't think you could do that. Oh, I wonder how this will look. Oh, hang on. Oh! Maybe. It's alright, little slime man. <gasps> oh, how could I forget about pandas? Didn't we try to get it? We did, but Buster mauled him? Or 
Liam, yeah, one of them mauled him. Oh, man. I remember we got him to our house. Uh, I'm recording soon, by the way, because I'm excited about something. And then we had him in the boat. And then my dog got in the boat. And then I smacked boat, but I smacked panda. <laughs> Why am I talking like an idiot? Where's all my stuff? Oh, I think I had it in a chest. But yeah, then my dog killed him. We gotta go get pandas now. I am excited because... No, they didn't add it. Or I didn't update. <laughs> we got it now. What do you mean, what is Radical Heights? Only the best Battle Royale game that ever existed. Now? <laughs> Look, guys. Chains. Oh, my God. We can make chains. Add a little bug fix. Oh, man. Just give me them all. I'm wasting all my iron on this. Hang on. Give them all. Oh, man. These are expensive to make. <laughs> Boom, 42 chains. Do I have any of Derpy's cookies left? Oh, I do. A whole stack. I gotta make these last. By the way, <laughs> the same artist. You know what? I'm just gonna keep showing him off because I'm in love with his art. Uh, actually, I think it's a view of right here. Took another moment out of my episode. I think I was like sitting on that slab right there. Here's a picture of when I was sad that <laughs> Derpy disappeared. Look how cool that looks. Got the little chickens in the cauldron. Oh, that's awesome. Thanks again for the art. That is so awesome. If you ever send me really cool art, I would be I would love to show it on here. Room's looking pretty small. Oh god. So I don't know if you guys saw this, but the confirmed mobs that are coming to Minecraft, supposedly it's from a Minecraft news page, not the official page, but a lot of people retweeted and liked it. So we have goats coming, frogs, vultures, ostriches, meerkats, and termites. Now, those seem like some animals that might come to Minecraft, but that just got me so excited for this game. <laughs> I think I'm mostly excited for frogs. They're going to be in the swamp for sure. <laughs> All right, we now have almost two stacks of chains. These are kind of expensive, but that's a lot to work with. Now I can go on my crazy spree of updating things. Oh, man, where do I begin? First off, these hanging lights definitely need to be updated. Don't need to use the iron bars anymore. And I don't even know if I should use those. Should I just replace those with lanterns? It looks all right. Uh, let me see what it looks like with a lantern. Do these give off the same amount of light? Man, what looks better? I mean, I like the chain more, but I don't know. <laughs> he looks so lonely. <laughs> Maybe he's waiting for his love interest. They're going to carve their name under that tree. I'm here, buddy. It's me. I'm the love <laughs> Oh, thank you. Man, that satellite looks good. I need to make some more of those. You guessed it. We're in the factory. No, we're not finishing it today. Uh, I'm actually doing this right here. So I found some more things for chains. It's It has to come to me. Like, can't just go around and put a bunch of chains everywhere and I thought of the factory and this place is great for chains we're gonna be hanging stuff in here we're gonna be making things so I think this bottom floor is gonna be very industrial so I'm gonna have like a few big furnaces and I made this tunnel right here because this links up directly to the lab look at this I have a perfect tunnel over this way and I'm actually gonna go ahead and build this tunnel here and I'm gonna make a glass roof because I want it to be different from the others because look at this foliage right above it it looks so nice. I want it to look jungly up there, even though it's pine trees. But Snack break. What is your favorite chip out of all chips? I think mine has to be sour cream and onion from Lay's. Not a sponsor. Even though they should sponsor me, I just now put the flavor sour cream and onion in 100,000 people's minds. <laughs> so, yeah. Thanks. No. <laughs> but yeah, seriously, what is yours? I'd like to know. Stupid chicken. I don't want that. These guys look good. Wait, is Dr. Bean still here? Dr. Bean? Bean? Wait. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No. Whoa. This place has thinned out quite a bit. Oh my god, where's Bean? Is that Bean? Bean! <gasps> no, Peter! I like you, Peter, but I want Bean. Are you telling me the only villager that disappeared here is Dr. Bean? That's strange. I'm assuming it's a despawn because if a, well, maybe a zombie got in, killed Bean, and then this guy took care of him. Oh no, Dr. Bean, he was my main scientist. 
A turtle despawned too, and I was just here not too long ago. Okay, I'm starting to notice things on this bug update. I hope there's not a... Oh no. There better not be a despawn bug. Gosh dang it, man. There is a despawn bug. My test subject is gone. This sheep has been in here forever. Now it's gone. Oh no. This is going to worry me now. Do you know how many pets I have back at home? Let me go give a check on them real quick. Oh, the sheep are still here. Everyone's... Well, I guess the sheep didn't have a name tag on them. It's just that Dr. Bean did. Okay, so I've weirdly enough decided to make this hallway out of brick. Well, I haven't yet, if you haven't noticed. <laughs> but I'm not going to go with concrete and quartz. Uh, I want it to match that. I even want it to look like maybe this is an old section of the... What if this was the first lap? And it's connecting to the new lap. Oh, my God, wait. Okay, I might... Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm... Oh, my God, it's all hit me now. What if I made this like the old lab? I know the f top floor is already mass storage, but... What if I did something like that? Still need to add the lights up there. Oh my god, everything's hitting me now. I can add those droopy lights up there. Okay, but I do need to go get a lot of brick. So I need to do some... Well, I need to go swimming in some rivers, really. Well, need some sugar cane. This is kind of what I did, by the way. Just kind of merged the two. Oh, now that I think of it, this is what I wanted to build over there at the factory, is a giant sugar cane tower. One of the automatic ones. That was like one of my favorite things to build in Xbox 360 Minecraft, and I think I might do that here. Wait, great idea for chains. I need to add some drooping lights in here. There we go. I guess that looks all right. So I didn't realize this is actually a new biome right here. Since when? <laughs> what is this called? It looks cool. Like, it's not shaded like savannas, and it has coarse on the ground. I didn't know this is an actual biome. I don't know what it's called, though. Okay, I need to find a river. Here's a river. <sighs> wow, immediately ocean music starts playing. <laughs> Wait, why is ocean music playing? <laughs> oh, no. This isn't... This is silk touch. Oh my god, guys. I am so... This music just reminded me. I started the Nomadic series back up. How did I... I guess it's just my busy lifestyle right now. I, it kind of just went right over my head. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, I gotta record. I just go straight to this. Oh my god, guys. I'm so sorry. Well, um, I do actually want to <laughs> work on that world. Oh, man. Seriously, I am sorry for the ones that have been waiting for that. I completely forgot all about it. <laughs> Dang. I wonder where it's going to hit. Oh, no. Right here. <laughs> Still can't believe some of these are... F oh, here's another one. Oh, that one's going to go on forever. Can you believe how long ago we fought the weather and those things are still loaded in chunks? Who can I use here? David? No... That's old. Holy crap. Rub some dirt on it. What about Earth Eater? Alright. Oh! Forgot how high the limit was. Holy crap. <laughs> Ooh. Not doing good on coal. Oh man. Whoa. Man, this thing eats through coal. I don't even have any in my world. You know what? I really have to dedicate an episode to just going on a huge mining spree and like focus on iron and coal. I tried doing that like not too long ago, but I, I guess I get sidetracked. I don't know. I really need to focus on that though. All right, I found some. Just do the average run through my world and steal it from furnaces. Um, excuse me? Okay, well, that is messed up. Oh, wait. No, it isn't. I didn't... F oh, I didn't let it filter in. Gosh dang it. How are these guys doing? Just waiting for my stuff to smelt. Hey, Dr. Banner. Oh, your subjects are still here. Working hard, I see. Nice. All right, I already created a stack and a half. How much can I get now? 
Just about two stacks. Okay, we'll <laughs> we'll be able to make at least like one section. All right, I'm getting bored. I'm gonna go build. I have three Diamond Fortune 3 picks back home, and they're all at level 33 to repair. That's insane. I found this iron one, and I wanted to see if they fixed it. Oh my god, thank you. They fixed it. They fixed it. It wasn't in the changelog, although I don't think they show everything they fixed in the changelog, because they fix a lot of stuff. I'm just happy. <laughs> I'm happy. Oh, I can get quartz now. Sweet. I am going to answer today's comment question of the day while I build this from Jackson Allen. With an X. That's interesting. What's been your favorite activity during quarantine? If Minecraft, then what else have you done? So, I mean, I guess Minecraft... I, I still kind of play Minecraft as much as I normally would. But uh, I'd say my activities... I've been going hiking a bit by myself. I don't like bring people. Not that that's an issue. Like, my county doesn't have... Well, actually, it has. <laughs> In the past month, cases went from like 0 to... 100 real quick <laughs> no, not just saying zero to 100 real quick for the saying like literally zero to 100 cases um and it was all in a nursing home too which is kind of sad because it's full of old people and i think a lot of them have died already which is even more sad um but they're containing it pretty well like not a whole lot of people have been getting out and it's not been getting out to us a whole lot but yeah, I've always enjoyed hiking and fishing, so I kind of picked that up here and there. But uh, since I'm getting ready to move, I've been taking on the task of buying furniture online mainly, which kind of sucks because you don't really get to see it in person. Um, but it's like a really fun process. It's so fun. Because when you first get your place, which I'm not there yet, it's probably going to be mid-May, like I said, <laughs> but you get to pick the style of it. And that's always the most exciting part is like, I get to pick. Wow. So I've been doing some of that, but I've also been doing a lot of homework since it's all at home. And speaking of homework, I still need to write a paper. Oh, man. It's like a big group project paper, 30 pages long. We have to suggest a media company for a client to invest in. I don't know how I'm going to put that into, I think, my five pages I have to do, but we'll see how that goes. I brought some of this because I don't think I want it all to be brick. I want this kind of to be an old section, so make it look like some of it's kind of deteriorated. Oh yeah, that's gonna look really good. So I decided to use polished andesite for just kind of a, a breakaway layer, um, but that's all the brick, that's all of it. <laughs> well, I still have some in the industrial furnace, which actually I'm gonna be making another industrial furnace in here because it would just make sense. I think this place is going to look great. All of these are going to have glass windows on the top. Um, I'm going to plant a lot more trees around this just so you have that kind of foresty vibe above there. But yeah, it's going to look good. Well, I believe that is going to be all for today. Thank you for watching. You know what? I kind of forgot about my maintenance room here. Oh my gosh. Wait. What kind of block? Oh my god. Oh my god, there's some right there. <laughs> Dang it, I've been running all over the place looking for andesite. Yo, I still have some building blocks in here. Whoa, wait. That's probably a good looking block to use. When it's in stone form. Concrete form. <laughs> Sweet. And then all these chests, I forgot. I got a lot of stuff over here. Let's see what I got. Mainly just, ooh. Yeah, mainly just building. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Depth Strider. I have 30 books here? Come on. I have a golden apple here? Come on. <laughs> what the heck? What's that? Treasure map? <gasps> I'm assuming I already found that. Oh, more books. Yo, I got some cool stuff in here. Hang on, I'm almost done. Hang on. Even though it is the end of the episode, so... <laughs> Oh, I got some sand. I can use that. All right, we're good. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching today's episode. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.